um, just for fun, sometimes I take a tile and I pick up some of the paint. A lot of times, like if I have this much paint sitting around, I'm going to do a couple of tiles. So, um, I just get it on my spatula or palette knife and then just gently place it on the tile and you can maintain the patterns. It can be a lot of fun. You can get some really good tiles. I was wanting that red right here. No. <laughs> it's hard to do it on a spinner. I don't think I've ever done it with a spinner before. Interesting. I'm going to sneeze. I'm telling you right now. I have got sinuses for days. <laughs> Everybody's looking at me sideways, like, Corona! I'm like, no, sinuses, every year, forever. Okay. There, I got a little bit of red. There's another patch of red. I'm going to put it right here. And as always, you want to think about your composition and kind of mix up the colors. Like I don't put all the red beside each other and the gold is spread out. These tiles are so much fun. If you resin them, the colors just really pop. So it's like getting a freebie. All right, we've got some gold. I want to put it over here. Hmm. I would like some blue, like right here. Some of the bright blue. All right, I'm going to pick this up and put it in the middle where that blank spot is. It's going to make that more interesting. It would have filled in, but I wanted to put more color there. So, all right, there it is. And I will show you all the dried result later. All right, guys. Here is the little tile that I made out of the paint from the strainer. So, look how good that turned out. So pretty. It's got a lot of movement. You've still got all the colors, the golds, the blues, a little bit of red. So there it is. Don't waste your paint. You can do a whole nother project with it. So much fun. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. Be inspired.